Hello, Serge here from the back porch. And it's the first really cool day we've had this this fall. It's the first day that it's barely into the 60s and until a little while ago when the sun's really gotten high, it's been really chilly. And so I think today I'll use this uh, fact that I'm wearing long sleeve shirts here, which is uh, because it's this cool today, that I think I talk a little bit about what it is to uh, be ready to play golf when the weather gets cool, chilly, and ultra cold. Now, if you're up north, you're already experiencing some really cold weather, and, and so I don't need to tell the northerners that much about it, but for those here in the south, uh, we could kind of, so to speak, get caught off guard uh, with a cold day coming in and, and going to play golf and not being prepared. By prepared, I mean making sure that either in our cars and or in our golf bags, we have some of our cold weather gear, uh, which would involve mittens, which would involve ski caps and, and earmuffs even, uh, hand warmers that you're ready to uh, you know, fire those things up to keep your hands warm, and, and, and some extra cold weather gear in your car like your uh, rain jackets and or uh, windbreakers or whatever, sweaters, and as well as if it's not too bad, just having, having uh, vests, sweater vests to wear. The key is, is to be prepared and be ready. The worst thing would be to get out there and uh, go, to a, go to play golf and you get there and you're just not prepared and you don't have the gear that you need to keep yourself warm. Because once the weather gets cold, the, most, the number one most important ingredient to playing good golf is that, is that you are going to be able to keep yourself warm. It's no different in hunting uh, or any time you're out there in the cold or to go skiing or, or ice skating or whatever. I mean, I grew up north. I know what it is to, to get cold and, the, and, to, and, and especially to play golf when it's cold. And even down here, I play golf all through the winter uh, when I'm home and I'm not doing schools or doing other things. Uh, I like to get out at least walk nine holes in the afternoon, kind of mid-afternoon when at least the sun's the highest and it's the warmest. But I'll play, I'll play in, in freezing weather, 30 degrees outside, 32 degrees, as long as the, wiz the wind isn't blowing too bad. But I will be, I'll be dressed care uh, appropriately for it. Basically now we've got these new all, uh, uh, clothes you can wear, under the shirts and things that, that you wear that keep uh, really clinging tight to your body, and, and they're the, the thermal underwear and stuff like that, you can wear that. Uh, I saw a golf tournament on TV this morning in Europe, the weather was pretty bad over there, and, and saw one guy in short sleeve shirts, but everybody else was wearing sweaters, and most everybody was, were wearing their rain, their rain pants to you know, keep, their, keep their legs warm. So know, know what you need to keep warm and because keeping warm is the key to playing good golf especially keeping your hands warm and remember it's, it's good to wear a hat out there because because any kind of hat is going to keep the, the heat in the greatest amount of heat loss is through the head and so lose your heat through your head I guess and your hands and your fingers are going to get cold so wear those extra socks or get those those extra thermal socks that are good for like again they say hunting down to 20 below zero or whatever you want to stay warm because staying warm is the key when you play golf in the winter time, and it's great to play golf in the winter if you can. Uh, naturally, if you're in a snow uh, where snow is there all winter, you're kind of stuck. So hitting into nets in your garage or your basement or whatever, or or any facility near you that does have that that indoor range or whatever is great. And if you can build that facility at your house, you're doing good. And and again, if you can play golf because there isn't snow on the ground like I can do here in South Carolina, uh, in the upstate we're a little cold. We're the coldest part of the uh, of of South Carolina, but I, like I said, as long as the wind's not blowing, I'll dress appropriately and I'll be out playing golf and getting my exercise in so to keep my body loose, keep my swing in shape, and, and, to, and to get that good exercise out there in a chilly day. Well, that's it for the search today about playing in cold weather. And if it gets a little damp on those days, even whatever, you also got to keep yourself warm and, and dry. So have all that gear in your car and in your bag so that you won't be caught off guard. And that way, Staying warm is the way to play good golf when it's cool. Well, that's it for today, and I'll be talking to you all again soon.